There is some kind of water snake. I don't know what that is. Good morning, everybody. We are on the trail. It's gonna be a nice sunny day today. It's supposed to get up to about 70 degrees. And we're going from Hawk Mountain Road, which is about mile 1235, up to Route 309, which is about 1246, 1247. So we're doing about 12 miles today. So thanks for coming with me. Let's take a walk. Well, this is recent as in like today or this weekend. There is some kind of water snake. I don't know what that is. Rattlesnakes don't usually go in the water. I don't know. That's just kind of interesting because we haven't seen that many pine trees on the trail. It's a black snake. He's really shiny. Sitting in the sun. I suspect he thinks he's hiding from me. Hello. It's a steep uphill, which I kind of expected. And we have reached Dan's pulpit. It's a great view. Okay, this is kind of interesting. I found another American chestnut tree. And there's a chestnut actually on the tree from last year. And this is in this is really a sprout. So this right here is the tree it's dropping these nuts and it's a it's a sprout coming out of a an old trunk obviously and there's three big ones coming up and i can see that there's a blight because you can see that the bark is kind of split on that big trunk but it's a pretty good size tree so this tree is really just shoots that came out of an old stump so that's an old 
chestnut tree here that's dead, but the sprouts, the shoots are coming out of it and bearing fruit. There are chestnuts all around the ground here again. So interesting. Now, I know I'm kind of geeking out about these American chestnut trees. I just think it's pretty cool to see them. It's like finding a, a rattlesnake or a bear or something like that, because I didn't know they existed until about two years ago. Now, here's the, another interesting thing. I don't know if there's something special about this location, or maybe I just, since I found some originally, now I know what I'm looking for. So when I cross them, I, I see that they're American chestnuts. But we are, every tree that I've seen has been in the Pennsylvania State game land. So I don't know if that has anything to do with it, if the way the land is preserved or something, but uh, it's, it's just exciting for me. Okay, this is interesting. We're going up and over those rocks. Huh. A lot of down trees here in this section, and it's pretty rocky, so it's really slow and going today. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but there's another chestnut tree. Lots of chestnuts all around here, right on the trail. We are going through a nasty rock scramble, but there was a spot where you can come up and look over the look over the ridge. This is pretty cool. I don't know what the three counties are, but we're at the three county, tri-county corner. So we are going that way. Huh. Looks like we're walking on the rocks for a while. Looks like we're walking up along that ridge again. We have reached the Allentown Shelter. This shelter is pretty small. It looks like it's kind of one of those kit ones, but it's different than the other ones that we saw. It has the tongue and groove logs, two bunks. Interesting thing about this shelter, I don't see any bear boxes or bear hangers. Not sure why. I'm sure there are bears around. I just wanted to show you this privy because it's pretty serious. Somebody put some time into that one and it's got a giant chimney on it. Hello sir, this is one of our trail maintainers. What, what's your name? My name's Mike. I'm with the Allentown Hiking Club. Okay. I appreciate it, Mike. Thanks for doing all your hard work. Oh, you're Makes welcome. the trail not trail nice. I mean, look at that. That's nice. <laughs> Thank you no, much. No place I'd rather be. Awesome. Thanks. This is a nice section. No rocks, basically a four-wheeler path. Route 309. Wait. 
made it. Well, we're gonna call it a day. That was uh, that was a long, rocky section. It was, <laughs> well, except for the end. So we we started off. It was kind of uphill, pretty steep. Then um, then a lot of rocks for about five miles. It was really slow. But then we came out some uh, like a mining road or logging road there toward the end. So it ended up being pretty good. Um, but I, I did not make good time. So, um, so I, it, today was about 12 miles. We went from that Hawk Mountain Road to um, Route 309. Oh, we did see a black snake today and two more American chestnut trees. So that's kind of exciting. We had a good view at that one. Uh, Dan's pulpit, I think it was called. So anyway, thanks for coming with me, guys. And remember, where we're going, we don't need roads.